My name is Horace Brodnax III. I am a redshirt junior from Savannah, Georgia, and I play men's basketball here at USC Upstate. So I started playing basketball when I was about six years old. So just, uh, it was the first sport that I played, I think. And obviously, uh, with my dad playing basketball growing up and him being in college basketball, I've been around the game for a very long time. And so it's just been a part of my life since like I can remember. I don't know if there was like a single moment that like made me realize it. It's probably just been like growing up, just being around him, you know, a lot of people would just come up to you and say, hey, your dad was a player when he grew up, you know, just when he was uh, back in the day. And so um, just hearing that a lot, you kind of just realize, I guess, how good he was. He was a McDonald's All-American nominee, Mr. Florida Basketball in 1982, I believe, and won a state championship. And then he went on to play at uh, Georgetown University. He won uh, the 1984 National Championship, and he was the runner-up in 1985. There was an instant where he did coach, but it was like for like one game or two games where he coached me. And then, um, but obviously like just, that's who he is, he's a coach. So being around him all the time, he's always giving me tips and pointers and stuff like that. So he's been coaching me probably my whole life. Well, Coach Dickerson had recruited me out of high school, so we had made a connection there. And so when I entered the transfer portal after my time at Navy, he had reached out. And so he was really one of the only schools that was really interested in me. I think that this university, this program, this athletic department has like a sort of underdog feel. You know what I mean? I feel like we are like written off and and I feel like we're just waiting on an opportunity to be able to show the world who we really are. I'm a political science major with a economics minor and I usually say that I want to be a king you know and I don't have any particular profession that I want to go into right now but I know that the impact that I want to have is I want to have a, a large impact on people in terms of just like being a person who is all about love and prosperity and kindness and everything that's good about the world. And so if I can have that type of impact, I feel like I've done something right.